So what happens when Rotogrip takes their tried and true Microtrax cover, make it better, and then introduce a brand new core design? You get something out of this world. Stick around and I'm gonna tell you all about it. What is happening, Bowlers? Chris Beans here with Bowlers Rant, bringing you another ball preview from Rotogrip. Okay, I am super excited to do this one. Today is Monday, December 16th, 2020. Rotogrip just dropped a bombshell, a new addition to their HP4 line. Today, we are looking at the Rotogrip UFO. Oh my goodness, this ball looks like an absolute behemoth. Really like the core design, love the shelf peel, but I really, really like the specs. So let's just jump into that because that is what we do here at Bola's Rant. This ball features the Microtrax S20 uh, cover and it features the ET core, which stands for Equalizer Technology, and it is an asymmetrical weight block. The color is deep purple, baby blue, neon green, and the finish is 2000 grit Abalon. And the number's at 15 pounds, 2.52 RG with a 0.054 differential and a 0.016 asymmetric differential. So there is a lot of information to break down here. First of all, this is in the HP4 line, so that's there pretty much where asymmetrics live. This ball has Microtrax and it's asymmetric solid, so it's gonna replace the Halo, all right? So really cool, uh, some information about this ball on their cover. It is, and I quote, the newest formulation of our forever famous Microtrax technology will create greater traction in the heaviest of oils. The Microtrax S20 solid reactive cover stock is mixed with a higher nano ratio, which means more grab throughout the entire lane. Okay, so the Microtrax cover was featured on the Idol and notably the Halo. It's known, you know, with it's got nano in it. That's particle and it's known for blending wet dry, very specific uh, motion associated with it. And it looks like this is an upgraded version. And this is great for when you run into cliff conditions, you know, you need to blend the wet or the dry. Maybe it's a little too wet or a little too dry. The ball's not gonna over or under react. But now let's talk about the core. This is really, really important. So equalizer technology core, here's some information about it. The space age creation was developed with built-in cavities to emulate the use of an extra hole since as of August, 2020, the USB-C deems them illegal. The built-in equalizer cavities will help increase mid lane motion and continuation down lane. So a lot of times when you're dealing with an asymmetric solid, you know, they start up early, they burn up in the mid lane, and then sometimes they lose some pop down lane. But Rotogrip is saying, you know what? I got you covered because a lot of people would, you know, put a weight hole in the, in the, in the bottom half of the ball to increase the flare and give them additional pop. They can't do that anymore as of August. And Rotogrip saying, we're just going to go around that rule and we're going to put it in the core and give it to you right up front. And that's fantastic because now you've got Nano and a brand new core design and a ball that is basically going to be an absolute beast for the oil. Let's talk about shelf appeal. I really like the look of this ball. The swirls will be very, very easy to read as it goes through all three phases of ball motion so as the core migrates down the lane should be very easy to see when it starts to pick up and when it moves down lane now i've got some information on the release date of this ball it looks like it is coming out on january 17th 2020 if you want to learn more about this ball and where you can get it you i've got a link in the description where you can pick this up on bullismart.com so what do you think of the ufo do you like the colors do you like the core design what layout would you choose Drop me a comment, let me know, let's continue the conversation. More updates are coming, and until then, bow well.